Hi everyone, Joe here again. I've not done an update for quite a while um, because I've been out living life. Pretty weird, right? Uh, quick disclaimer before we go any further. Um, please don't leave me comments telling me I'm going to hell um, because I'm an atheist. Uh, it's not cool, bro. Um, number two, please don't leave me any comments telling me that I should try whatever natural therapy without some evidence to back it up. I'm totally cool with everyone leaving suggestions and all that kind of stuff, but make sure you leave me uh, some peer-reviewed research with control groups, because if I can't find any, I'm going to tell you I can't, and I'm going to have a go at you for it in the comments, because I specifically asked you not to. So, moving on. What have I been doing for the last couple of months? So, I had my uh, last set of scan results now uh, in... What was that, June? July? Yeah, in July. And things were stable then, so we waited three months. Um, I had my scan um, two weeks ago. I'm getting my results in three days. So what I've been doing in between having my scan, getting the... Um, sorry, between receiving results, having my next scan, and so on. Um, I've been on holiday, which is lovely. I uh, did go to Cornwall, did some bodyboarding, which was pretty awesome. Went to see some really nice places around Cornwall, and really enjoyed myself. Spent some, spent some great time with my wife, uh, with my parents. Um, dragged my mother into the sea for the first time, and got her in a wetsuit, splashing around, which is pretty cool. Um, me and my dad were doing some bodyboarding. Um, my wife was there as well, and she was did a bit of bodyboarding. They did some swimming around and all that kind of stuff. Did some rock pooling, crab hunting, not killing them, just looking at them and taking pictures. Um, that kind of stuff. But yeah, I saw some really, really beautiful bits of scenery, uh, which I will splice in whilst I'm talking, because apparently that's the thing that you can do when you edit videos. Not only did I do that, but I also held a 24-hour charity live stream, and that was in aid of the British Thyroid Foundation, and we managed to raise over £9,000, which is absolutely incredible. So really, really happy with the way that went. Uh, staying up for 24 hours when you have... <laughs> you're still really tired and you don't have full lung capacity due to cancer. Uh, it can be an interesting one. You have to remember to breathe and you have to remember to stay focused. And what I did with my 24-hour charity stream is uh, I play this game called Elite Dangerous. Um, I have a YouTube gaming channel called Commander Plater or CMDR Plater. And basically what I do is I play games, I talk to people at the same time, and that's basically it. Because if I'm going to play the game anyway, I might as well talk to people at the same time. Now, in with that, what I managed to do was gather together a bunch of other content creators, so that's people that uh, make videos, live stream, and are generally around in the community. And I had them join me for two hour segments. And during those two hour segments, what we did was uh, they sent me a challenge, and I took part in these challenges whilst kind of raising money uh, for the British Thyroid Foundation, just kind of getting people to do just give it. And you know what? It was really good. I really, really enjoyed it. At the end of it, I was very, very tired. Uh, due to my watery eye on my left side, it was a little bit, um, a little bit, a little bit unpleasant because I've been wiping it for 24 hours, and when normally I'd be asleep for a chunk of it, I'd wake up and it'd like sort itself out. So as time went on, my eye got a little bit tighter, and it started to uh, goo up a little bit more than you would have liked. Um, but no, in the end, it was great. Um, and at the end of it, we did this kind of this finale race with some of my friends, and I am. Um, I gave a very emotional speech, because after being awake for over 24 hours at that point, you get a little bit emotionally weak and you start kind of, you start to give in a little bit and your, your normal composure doesn't hold. But that's okay. That's alright. That's totally fine. Uh, so that was a great success. That was brilliant. Uh, everything else that I've done um, then became a time for a scan. Oh crap. Scan time again. I spent a lot of time seeing friends and family where I can. Um, and all that kind of stuff. Um, it's been interesting, I guess. There's some interesting things that have been going through my head and stuff, and uh, I'm always on the lookout for trials and things and trying to find a way to to live, really. And when I talk about living, living is normal stuff. Living isn't going and doing base jumping or bungee jumping or um, long jumping, because I'm running out of things to say, but I keep saying jumping. But no, life isn't... Normal life is the thing, and... Especially when your the other half has to work because they have to look after themselves for the future, which is probably that's probably my main priority. But I'm going to go off on a tangent I didn't mean to go off on now, I guess. But yeah, that kind of like 
that people telling you what you should do and how to live your life. You know, it's your life, do what you want. <laughs> Literally, do what you want. If it's going to make you happy now, do it. Because you won't have any regrets when you die because you're going to be dead. So, what can you do? My regret is I didn't get old. <laughs> Way! But, anyway, moving on. Uh, something else I did um, during that time between... Well, I had my scan, um, so two weeks ago, last weekend. I was... I uh, met with a group of friends from the online community from my YouTube channel. Um, we went out in London and we had um, a really, really good time. Had some drinks, had some, had some burgers, and we just kind of chatted and had a really good time, really good laugh, and it was fantastic to see people. Um, had people come all the way over from Texas, um, from Germany, um, from, I'm going to blow your mind, Leeds up north in the UK. Madness. But yeah, it was really, really good to see everyone, and it was fantastic stuff. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd do a quick update today, because I haven't done one for a while, and uh, people have been asking me, are you okay? What's going on? On the vlog channel, so I figured I would I would, uh, I would answer it uh, in video form. Uh, but as usual, guys, I'm going to say uh, thank you very much to everyone who's been watching. Um, something that we started doing last one, we do again. If you've made it this far, um, can you just leave me a comment saying, stinging nettle? stinging nettle, the weeds you get in your garden, stinging nettle, just because I want to see who makes it to the end, and um, I thought it was bloody hilarious <laughs> how many people um, left, left the comment last time. So, um, make sure that you like, subscribe for more updates, um, I've got sc scan results in three days, so I'll probably do an update after that. Fingers are crossed for stable again, I'm feeling good, I'm feeling healthy, um, ish, strong, I'm feeling strong. So we will leave all then. But once again, thank you very much for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.